Hey, it's Tisha. Um, it's the night before my surgery or the afternoon before my surgery. And um, my doctor requires you to drink magnesium citrate the night before surgery. So I had that. And here's the kind I used. It is um, American Fair uh, Magnesium Citrate. And I got the lemon flavor. My doctor's office actually said that the cherry flavor, that most patients actually liked it better. But I um, had a friend who had weight loss surgery. And she said the lemon flavor was better. So I got it really, really cold. And um, it wasn't that bad. I mean, it really was. It tasted kind of like a funky Sprite. So, um, but yeah, I chugged it and like a few big gulps and then it was gone and then after that I drank a whole bottle of water and now um, I'm only allowed to have water for the rest of the night and then nothing after midnight so um, yeah I took it at 3 o'clock it's 5 o'clock now so that's two hours and so far I've went to the bathroom four times and two hours <laughs> so um, yeah, hopefully it won't keep me up all night. <laughs> I also wanted to show you my spirometer. Um, this is to help with your breathing so that um, you don't set up anything in your chest while you're in the hospital, um, like pneumonia or anything like that. Because when you have the incisions on your stomach, you may be taking like short, shallow breaths. And um, you need to take those deep breaths to make sure you don't get anything caught in your lungs. So... Um, this is the spirometer and you can see right here it's got the um, the how much you breathe or whatever it's called the volume. the volume the inspired volume is what it says on it so all you do is yeah it kind of makes a Darth Vader sound and um, you just do it like slow and steady and so they gave me this last week and wanted me to do it a few times a day just to um, be getting in those deep breaths. And then I'll do that in the hospital. They want me to do it um, like, I think they said nine times an hour. So I'm going to do it every ten minutes um, that I'm awake. <laughs> so again, here's how you use the spirometer. You suck. You don't blow. Okay, so that's how you use the spirometer. Um, you may get one of those. And um, I'm excited. I'm nervous. Um, I'm more nervous than I have been here lately. But um, I'm excited. I'm ready for this. I'm ready to lose weight. I'm ready to be healthy. I'm just, I'm really, really ready to wake up tomorrow in the post-op recovery room. And them saying, you know, Tisha, you did great. Everything's fine. You know, and then get moved to my room, and um, I should get to come home on Monday. So, um, anyway, yeah, wish me luck, and I'll see you after surgery. Bye. Hey, there's one other thing I wanted to show you that the um, hospital gave me. It's this soap. It's um, antibacterial deodorant soap. Um, it contains antibacterial agent triclosan um anyway it's a lightly scented antibacterial deodorant soap and they want me to use this the um night before surgery which will be tonight they want me to bathe with it and then they want me to use this in the morning before i come to the hospital and just bathe with this wash my hair with my normal shampoo and put nothing else on no lotion um, makeup body spray perfume deodorant I thought that was weird it's like I want to put on some deodorant so <laughs> yeah I'm gonna put on some deodorant as soon as I can because that's just gross anyway so I wanted to show you the soap that they gave me talk to you later bye